Hub and Spoke is essentially care coordination, looking at um, community-based providers being more engaged in treatment of substance use disorders. So like other chronic diseases, making sure frontline providers have the capacity to do that. So what studies have shown is that community-based providers, um, primary care physicians don't feel comfortable providing that care because they don't feel like they have the addiction medicine specialist support to do that. So they feel like they would be out on their own. So a lot of studies looked at that. Vermont reacted to that by creating this hub and spoke system that uh, engages community-based providers in what are called spokes. And hubs are um, opioid treatment programs, otherwise known as methadone clinics. But in Vermont, they're very integrated. Um, so they are expected to take in stabilized patients, induct them onto appropriate medication-assisted therapy, provide wraparound support, and then push them out to community-based providers who maintain them and provide ongoing care within primary care uh, clinics. The commission is hearing from Vermont, uh, hearing, from, hearing, hearing from Washington State later this month. They'll be hearing from Rhode Island, hearing from California, and seeing how those states are doing it. It's not a, it's not a one size fit all. It's not apples to apples. It's apples to oranges. So that's the goal of the commission is to come together with those recommendations, provide that report to the governor and to the task force so that we can determine how, how to do it um, so it fits Wisconsin.